What's going on, guys? Day two, blog number two. Whoa, this lighting is a little off. Let's have another good day. So yeah, back to today's topic. You have potential to be something, all right? Now, people are gonna say, you can't do this. People are gonna say, that's too much for you. People are gonna say, you're not ready for that. That's all part of knowing that you could do it. You know why? Because those same people that are telling you, you can't do it, are the same people that are gonna be like, oh, how did you do it? When did you start doing this? How come you're doing this? What did you do to make this happen? All of those people talking about you not being able to do something are going to be the same people that are going to be there after recognizing that you had the potential, recognizing that you could do what you want to do, recognizing that you could get into things that people are going to tell you and bash you about it. So this is my equipment, uh, basic tools. We have the 440 steel saw, the 310 steel saw, uh, the 280 steel saw, and then we have the 170 saw. Uh, basically what we always use then, we have the, I can't remember which size this pole saw was. That's the HT. Saw with the steel BR550 lower. That's basically what we always use, what we always um, carry to do most of our jobs. Then he has the climbing saw up there. As you guys can see, the tree is bad completely, so you can't really climb it. So we have to get the feeling for the day. We just came back from break and look what we found. He almost burned us out. Oh no, it's coming from the <laughs> Crazy. All right, we just finished cutting everything down on the tree we started today. We have a mess, but we'll clean everything up and now we're just gonna timber. <clears throat> the rest of the tree down and we should be done with this tree then we have two more dead trees that we gotta get done but those trees are timbered as well so we're right on track for the day we have a lot of wood on the trailer it should be fun to dump 